Made in the Mist is a sightseeing boat tour that brings you right up to the three famous waterfalls on the Niagara River. Join us on this popular tour and prepare to get wet. This is Magellan. And this is Greyhound. Where we make videos about epic road trips, kayaking, hiking, and other outdoor adventures. This is part of our epic three-week road trip where we visited all five of the U.S. Great Lakes. This one's pretty straightforward. Buy your tickets, wait in a long but fast-moving line, take an elevator down, and board one of the two vessels to see the three Niagara Falls waterfalls. We're ready. <laughs> In 2020, these two new vessels were introduced completely powered by lithium ion batteries. One named the James Glynn, who has been the CEO of Made of the Mist for 70 years, and the other named Nikola Tesla, the inventor who contributed to the AC power system powered by Niagara Falls. Prior to these two vessels, all previous boats were named Made of the Mist. You don't really have a say where you are in the line when you're loaded onto the next available boat but hopefully you get a good spot on the upper deck. We chose the side of the boat facing Canada, but we'd choose the US side if we had to do it again. That side definitely got a better view. We're gonna get sprayed so hard. <laughs> The first of the falls you will see are the American Falls, the second largest in Niagara Falls, accounting for roughly 10% of the river's water flow. Bridal Veil Falls, the smallest, can be seen with many people in ponchos. Do you remember the Cave of the Winds video we did last week? This is a distant river's view of what we did in that video, so check it out. The last waterfall is Horseshoe Falls, which you will not be surprised to know accounts for 90% of the water from the Niagara River, and is almost entirely located in Canada. It is simply spectacular. On the way back, take note of the crow's nest viewpoint, which you can do before you hop on the elevator back to the top. Have you been on the Maid of the Mist? What was your favorite fall? Let us know. Otherwise, stay tuned for our next video on the top things to do while in Niagara Falls. We'll see you on the trails or in the water.